Hello everyone, this is Jeff Patel, Flater Mouse. Uh, today it was kind of overcast and I didn't have any direct sunlight. And when it's dark like this, I can't operate the high speed cameras at a real high frame rate. In my last video, I showed you guys a bunch of different stuff I had ready to go. Um, the number one most requested one was crayons, and probably the least requested was Pepsi, believe it or not. So I wanted to save the crayons when it was sunny and so we can you know operate the cameras at a higher frame rate and you'll notice that I'm not using my normal cardboard backdrop I put that there to kind of mute the sunlight when it's bright out and I'm using a white backdrop because of, of the low light to compensate for it anyway Pepsi is uh, mostly water it has a pretty high concentration of sugar which increases the boiling point I have no idea what the exact boiling point is of Pepsi, but I guarantee you we're going to get it much higher than that. In this one I wanted to try something different. I put a cup of ice water underneath the test tube hoping it would shoot in there and the thermal shock would make the test tube shatter. Unfortunately, even though it was only about an inch above the, the uh, cup, it still missed. So the cap blew off, the silicone plug didn't completely blow out. So it was a, like a super rocket, but you could see how erratic it flew. Now a lot of people have suggested, hey, why don't you turn the test tube upside down and shoot it straight up like a rocket? The problem with that is there's nothing to stabilize it. There's no way to attach fins to a piece of glass like that and you know heat it up and keep the fins on there. And it would just be completely unpredictable and dangerous. So using the the plug that blows out and, and point it straight down it gives me a lot of predictability and a lot of safety now about the crayons I lied to you I, I actually did the crayon but I had too much heat on it and I had a glass tube failure had some cool results though um, I plan on redoing that and reshooting it when it is sunny though anyway I hope you enjoyed this thanks for watching